and I'm going to do file open and I'm going to do this example from the textbook, the potato chip one. So here I'm opening up the data set from the textbook. Those are available on PolyLearn. You should have already downloaded them. So here's the potato chip data, frying time and moisture content. To do linear regression, I'm going to do analyze fit y by x and then drag my y variable to the y response box that's the response variable and the x variable to the x factor box and click ok here i get my scatter plot if you want the least squares regression fit click on this red triangle and do fit line okay obviously not the best fit for this data as we went over in class but this is just an example so you get your linear fit your prediction equation you get your r squared coefficient of determination your root mean squared error that's the regression standard deviation you get this table that has your different sum of squares sum of squares model sum of squares residual or error sum of squares total and then this other table also has your two coefficients and some additional information we'll get to later um, if you want to get a um, residual plot, then click on this red triangle and then do plot residuals. And you'll actually get um, four plots. Uh, the one that you want is the residual by x plot. So it has residuals on y um, and x as the x axis. Um, in order to cut and paste them, you're going to do... Um, you want to do right click on a Windows and on a Mac you do control click on this gray triangle and then you can do edit select control C control D etc to cut and paste that plot so that's how you can do your um, linear regression and residual plot now if you want to exclude uh, one row from your data set say we want to exclude value 5 then just select that row, then go down to the red triangle next to rows, and then do exclude. So this means it's going to be excluded from the next fit. So the next time you do the regression, then you'll see that that point is excluded. So here it's just showing that point number 5 is not included in the fit. So that's how you can do linear regression, residual plot, and exclude a point from your data set in jump.